Hey guys, thanks for checking out Armatist Reviews. Today I'm going to be reviewing slash comparing the Bravo Concealment uh, Belt Loops, the regular style and the pancake style. My couch for my MMT 92. Alright, so this is the Bravo Concealment BCA holster from my Glock 23, which I converted to a 9mm threaded barrel with uh, the Lone Wolf Distribution converter barrels. Um, right now, it has, if you guys can kind of see that, it has the kind of the, the default belt loops that come with this. Um, very um, high profile, they stick up quite a bit. Um, and, uh, they work, but uh, these pancake loops are supposed to be better, supposed to keep um, the holster closer to your body. This is an outside the waistband holster, this is not inside the waistband. So um, I'm going to first uh, put this on and see if I can get a good shot on how this will look and then put the pancake uh, loops on, see if I notice a difference in, in uh, printing, see if I can notice that it's a little bit tighter to the body. So yeah. Okay, so right now, I just have the BCA holster on, no gun, regular belt loops, Core Essentials uh, Tactical Trackline Belt. This is actually a SOG Gambit that I just got in Tac Pack box. Um, I'll put links to all the descriptions, or put all the links in the description down below. Okay. This is empty, nothing in there. Okay, so I'm gonna put that on. See if you guys can notice any kind of difference. I don't know if you can or not. So the gun is right here. Try to kind of get in this area, see if you guys can see anything. I am looking at a really small screen, so I don't know how noticeable it is. Okay, so from my angle right here, I can see the slide sticking out quite a bit. I can see a very obvious print from my angle. In fact, I think you guys can see right there too. So, um, you know, it's outside the waistband. So it's obviously going to print a little bit more. We will see. We will tighten this up a little more to make sure it's got nice and snug on the body. Um, so yeah, it does stick out probably get away with it and most people probably wouldn't notice unless they were really looking um, but uh, let's put the pancake style loops on see if we can notice the difference I have um, shot with this holster um, with the pancake loops and seemed to work fine didn't have any problems um, and uh, shot really well all right so let's put the pancake loops on and uh, see if we can notice any kind of difference at least if I can notice any kind of difference all right, so we're back, and we have the pancake style um, belt loops on now. And I think, I don't know, personally, it seems like it does keep it a little closer to your body. I don't see it sticking out as much here from my perspective. Um, I can still see it, but I'm hoping it's not that much more. It doesn't seem like it anyway. So tell me what you guys think. Okay, so you got it right here. Okay. Same setup, make sure you got everything snug on the belt. So, um, try to keep my arms not so stretched out. I think I did have my arms a little stretched out when I did it the first time, so we'll do both. So, um, I'll take a picture and uh, show you what it kind of looks like my perspective looking down from, from up here. Um, but uh, I mean, it, you can kind of see it, but I don't think it's nearly as much personally. Seems to, to do just fine. So I think the pancake um, belt loops are, are worth it. Um, they seem like a, like a nice addition. They're not too expensive. So when you got buy the belt loops, the pancake loops, um, they do come with the necessary hardware that you need to put it on. Um, so you don't need to swap out 
the the screws and the and the nut and the, and the, the uh, O-ring and things uh, like that. You don't need to swap those out when you switch pancake loops. You can keep them all together. They, they give you basically just an extra set of hardware with the new loops. Um, I do like that uh, you know belt loops have a lifetime warranty. If for some reason they break, something happens, um, they will take care of it. Bravo Concealant has a great warranty and uh, it does have free shipping, which is nice. Hey, welcome back to my level. I realized I had you guys down low still. Um, so anyway, the uh, price, I don't remember the exact price at the moment. It's not very expensive. Um, I'll put it in the video. I'll probably put the description, uh, the link in the description uh, to the pancake uh, belt loops as well. Um, but the price is for a pair. It's not like, you don't know, just like buy one or something like that. It's for a pair. Um, and uh, you have a 30 day money back guarantee. For some reason you don't like it after 30 days, send it back, get your money back. It does seem to bring the gun a little closer to your body, I feel like. It seems to be a lot lower profile. Um, they do have one and a half and one and three quarter inch um, uh, sizes available for your belt. And the hole spacing from end to end on the pancake belt loops are two and three quarters. So if you have a different holster um, that's not Bravo uh, concealment that you want to use these belt loops with, you just got to make sure they have a hole spacing of two and three quarters. So yeah, that's about it. I mean, pretty basic. They're just belt, pancake belt loops. So um, if you guys are thinking about getting them, I would say get them. A uh, good little upgrade for your BCA holster or any other holster that may work with. Uh, if you guys have any questions, let me know and I will get uh, an answer for you if I don't have it. And uh, I'll put links down in the description below. Check those out. If you aren't subscribed already and you want to see future videos, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. I'm going to do some uh, more giveaways in the future. I just did a giveaway, a couple giveaways not long ago. Um, I gave away a Cortac uh, belt and I gave away uh, five printless wear uh, undershirts to help reduce uh, mitigate printing so I'm um, gonna do some more giveaways in the future so hit subscribe if you want to keep up to, up to date on that and uh, if you want to see future videos if you guys have any feedback let me know uh, if you have something I, you'd like me to review uh, within reason because I do not have uh, a ton of money for the channel but uh, if it's something within reason let me know and I'll take a look at it so uh, thanks for watching guys take care <laughs>